where you can provide a quick and easy way to convert images to a different file type. For this logo image, after resizing it to 160 pixels square, I'm also going to want to change it from a PNG file to a JPEG. There's nothing really wrong with it being a PNG, but as a JPEG its file size will be reduced even more. Usually the only reason to upload a PNG to a web page is if it's needed to use transparency. Only PNG files can do that. Both the logo files on the MacU.com and SwansonDigital.com are PNG files that use transparency to let the blue background show through. So after reducing the size of the image, I'm going to then go to File, Export, and select JPEG as the file type. Below with the quality slider, we can reduce the file size even more. When set at the very best quality, it's at 34K, which is only 6 kilobytes less than it was as a PNG file. But take the quality just down a notch, and the file goes all the way down to 13K. That's a super small file size and exactly what I want for the front page of a website. So I'll rename the exported file to Preview Logo Web and save that to the desktop. Just like with Adjust Size, we can also convert multiple files at once. The only catch here is that they need to all be the same file type to start with. So all four of these are PNG files. I'll reduce their sizes to 160 by 160, and then export them as much smaller JPEG files. Notice that we can also convert image files to PDFs, either from the export menu or directly from the file menu here. This will come in useful later in the tutorial when we look at combining PDFs.